Hey everyone, how's it going? This is me, Tira, uh, and today we're going to be doing a mod showcase on Agrocraft. Uh, it's a mod that basically helps you out with growing things and speeds either uh, it's for you to speed up your growing of crops and stuff and it's also compatible with other mods and those are the, uh, there's like flowers and stuff um but let's start talking about some of these items so let's start with the irrigation channel so this is what the irrig there's two types of irrigation channel they're named the exact same thing but they both have different crafting recipes so let's see recipe this one has four um Oak, uh, four planks and then you could choose whichever uh, plank you want uh, you could even use planks from other mods so thumbcraft uh, now and then there's also these uh, larger ones and those are just for the smaller irrigation cha um, irrigation channels and then you just get one out of it and then oh yeah and then these just these give you six per craft uh, and this is basically how they work together uh, you can connect uh, this if they're the same wood type you can connect them together but if you were to get uh, different ones so let's get acacia here they don't link up together and this is just so you can have like two farms close to each other uh, there's more it, it's more of an aesthetic thing so see how there's they could be together but if you were to put them like together like that they'll just hook up to each other so that's basically the main reason why uh they can't hook up to each other as for the for the woods and then mainly this one the the larger irrigation irrigation channel is for it's for something like this where you, let's say you have to go past a wall if you were to have your this uh, uh wooden water tank if you were to have a wooden water tank and that hook that's hooked up to an irrigation channel you don't want it to just go through a wall like this and it's just it's mainly for builders um for an ex building aesthetic but if you have it like this it looks like it goes through the wall and it doesn't it's not as like oh look at that there's a hole right there and something like this but yeah that's basically the irrigation channel if you were to put water let's see okay let's get a water bucket if you were to put a water in here and the channel where it was to get filled up if you break the the middle one this one keeps all its water and this one keeps all its water and this one keeps all its water but once you place one the they they try they try to equalize and they and this one fills up but then this one this one lowers down and then break it and then put it back break it put it back break it put it back break it put it back and just keeps going down 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 because you're losing when you're breaking the, one of them you're break you're losing water from the, from it see it just keeps going down um so yeah I, uh there's actually a number of of uh millibuckets of how much uh in in them that it could taken and it remembers how much how many middle buckets it has uh so yeah that's the irrigation channels now let's talk about the seed storage seed storage is basically like a chest so if you if uh that could take seeds so let's t oh, let's get some seeds and let's get some uh stick like this and then let's actually we need a bunch of these okay so basically if you have any sort of seed that is that has been analyzed we'll talk about this in a second um as you can see once it's analyzed it has a one 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 now if we were to mutate them and we'll talk about mutation in a second if you were to oh wait if you were to mutate um the the wheat seed that you have see Let's go into survival. Okay, and then let's. Okay, and then let's search. Let's analyze this one. And this is a one 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 since it's from the parents. But if you were to put them together. Okay. It once it's uh, mutates together, then it'll uh, either gain or lose something, lose a uh, a ranking. But for this purpose, we'll whatever it is, we'll we'll use it. Let's see. Let's analyze this. So there's a two in growth. All right. Now, if we go over here with the seeds, if you put 
um, these seeds in here, the seeds go in there. And then you see it's hooked, it's linked to a specific seed. Uh, so if we do something like seed, seed, and put pumpkin seeds in here, they don't, are they're not going to go in there because it's already linked to seeds. But if you were to put this one, two, one in here, it gets its own slot and you see this bar, it goes up on the middle one, which is the middle one's gain. So, uh, like seed, seeds, seeds are exactly the same, will clump together, but seeds that aren't will be on its own side. So gain is the top. So let's, if we click on gain, gain, because there's a higher gain, it goes closer to the left, which is where um, most of this, the, which is where most of the, where the higher, it goes from highest to lowest. So if, if any of the other ones, they don't really matter because uh, it's, they all they're all one so if i it, so this will always stay on the left just because it's always a one but if we do something like this let's see yeah also if you click it once you only get one seed uh, that's just so most likely people don't want billions of seeds all at once okay let's put these guys in here and let's scroll them again and hopefully we get uh something changed at the uh, in the other two just so i can show you what i mean with it let's see Get to the highest level. All right. Oop. And then let's see. Okay, there we go. We got another seed. Also, if you want to put them in the in the chest analyzer or the chest in the seed. Um, oh yeah, there's a two on strength. If you want to put it in um, the seed storage, it has to be analyzed first. So you see, there's a one one one. One two one, one two two. So if you put in strength, this one goes first since it's a two. But if you put gain, this stays there, and this one's second. But if you go to growth, it stays the same because they're all the same. Um, and this one, these are just uh for, for uh, these are just for if you have a bunch of different seeds. So like you, maybe you want one of each. So one, one growth. And then one one one, and then two growth, and then one one, and then three growth, one one. Uh, you just in just in case you, you uh you don't know what people really want. So this this is just for flipping through uh, all the pages. Uh, and then if you take these out, and you press this X, it doesn't show up. There the it's unlinked to a seed. So you can put pumpkin seeds now in here. Oh wait. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't analyze these, uh, as I guess, as I, as you can see now, you have to analyze the seeds, or then the, the, or the organization thing gets, gets thrown out the window, because, the, well, what's it organizing, really? There we go, now it's in there, and now it's like the seeds, into pumpkin seeds, now if you put these in here, they don't go in that side, sorry, they don't go inside, but the pumpkins do, and then if you unlink them, and then you cannot put these in here. And that's basically the seed storage. Next are fences, and these are agrocraft fences. So if you see, you see below it, fence material, and there's material, it says oak wood planks. So if you look at the recipe, you can actually turn, turn uh, the normal fences to agrocraft fences, um, and, which for oak isn't really that important, but uh, you can use it with spruce to make wood, spruce wood planks and then birch and then jungle and then acacia and then dark oak and then it's also compatible with um, any other mod that has wood in it so silver wood and great, uh, great wood uh, so you just put whatever plank you want it to be in the middle and eight around with the normal fences and then you could um, also put these fences around uh, any any wood and it turns into the other wood so it's cross changeable and those are basically the fences next are the fence gates and the fence gates are just um, the fence with any material you want it to be and then the oak or the plank that corresponds to it so fences that are material that the material is made out of spruce you need a spruce plank um, if you have birch planks, if you have a birch plank wood for your fence, then you need a birch plank for it. 
and so on and so forth, including the any other mod that has wood in it. And then fence gates, you just right click, and it works just like any old gates. It um, opens any the direction that you're facing as well. And that's the fence gate. Next are the wooden grates, and the wooden grates are just for vines you can place on them for decoration. You could you could basically put them anywhere in the beginning of a block, at the end of a block, in the middle of a block, on the floor, on the tops of of uh, of of blocks, in the middle of blocks, horizontally vertically so on and so forth and for these you they they place on the grates but they don't spread at all um just this uh if you were to just put it in not the same way uh, not the same way as if you were to place it in a normal normal um block so let's get torch this is uh this is for church arena it's just to quicken the tick rate and see it spreads but these don't spread and let's actually move it over here just so it's closer to it uh, and these don't spread anywhere um, there is something where if you it looks like it could it's it works when you do something like this it's break. oh yeah those don't break if I, unless I break this it works if it looks like it might work like this when it's like this Like this, it looks like it's spreading, but it's not really spreading at all. It's, if you can see, it's pretty, it's in front of the block. Um, but if you place it like this, you can see there's a double layer of vines because this, the ones connected to the wood grates are, are one layer and the ones that are next to it are another layer. And that's basically what the wooden grates are. Next, to explain these items, I need to actually show you them. So this up here is a wooden tank, and my wooden tank goes from this. This is the floor of the wooden tank, and this is the top of the wooden tank, and it's all filled with water, um, as you can kind of see down, down, down there, the how deep it is. Um, but that's just a, a, a glitch. Um, this right here is not an irrigation, um, ir irrigation channel like one like uh, from over there. This is an actual tank that hooks up, as you can see. Um, if I were actually to put an irrigation channel here at where it is connected right here, see it doesn't hook up even if it's the right one. Here, let me just so you guys can see. Um, Actually, we need to go to Agrocraft. Irrigation, 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 dark oak, or spruce. It, it looks like it hooks up, but it doesn't really, as you can see, uh, it doesn't combine with all the, the rest of them. So you need to put a tank here for it to all work together as one. And that and that's just uh, the tank, the wooden tank. And then these wooden tanks actually, if you have different mods, which let me f delete these. I'll explain why they had a little bit of water in them. And you probably saw it from the from the wooden grates um, part. If I have a bucket of water, um, these work. These wooden uh, grates or these wooden um, water tanks work with other mods so this is the uh, the ender tank it basically transfers liquids from one ender tank to another end tank if it's they're linked together and then this uh, this is set to output and this is set to input so if I would put water in here the other one will get it as you can see if I fill one it fills the other one and also it fills up the tank right here so it, it's outputting this the water is outputting to this wooden tank but something else you can also do is put um, water straight into it. And for me, the fastest way I've found to do this, um, if you were in survival game mode, it, and if you were in survival and all you had was aircraft, is just have a water source next to the tank and then 
where I click back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I try to do something like this, where I could um get the water, and then get the the tank. But if I shift, I pick up the water, but I don't place it in here because I'm shifted. I can't interact with it while I'm shifting. And if I just right click it alone, I take out water from the water tank, but I don't pick up the water um, from the source block. So I'm I have to go left click without shifting to both until it's all the way full. Uh, also, another way, and that's that's how these had water in them. If I were to put weather, uh, rain start raining it starts this starts filling up with the water but it's extremely slow filling up with water so i try not to fill i this is this is just for like if you if it if you get a bit of if you get a bit of water that's good if you saw actually um this filled up with water or like you you saw a tick fill fill up so um this does fill up uh, fill these up with water though it's extremely slow and uh, it's going to take a long time until it's completely full. So something like um, so something like this water water tank, it will probably take like days and days and days of rain to actually fill up. So thankfully, I have creative and all that um, slash key mode. So that's uh, uh, what the watering tank is. Now, the watering tank, uh, the these irrigation channels connect to the watering tank, and they travel down, 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 and they you can actually take uh, water out of uh, out of the system to grow your plants quicker by place placing sprinklers on there, and these are just recipe. These are just a plank of a new type, iron um, ingots, buckets. Bucket is just uh, uh iron ingots in a V shape. And then iron bars. Iron bars are just um, six iron on top. Bottom doesn't really matter. And you get sixteen out of them. Uh, these um, actually these sprinklers actually hook up to whatever uh, uh, whatever wood your irrigation pipes are. So let's get a jungle. If I put place this here, it doesn't link up because they're not the same wood type. And if you place the sprinklers, as you can see, it looks like it, it's oak, but it converts to any wood type you you have it connected to. So now this one ha is um in jungle wood. If our if our also these um the sprinklers don't place like normal. The only place to irrigation channels. So let's touch up with oak. And you can see it. It just links to whichever you have it on. These are actually really cool. These are um, wooden channel valves. So recipe is just an iron ingot. A lever lever is just cobblestone with a stick. And irrigation channels, it's just the wooden plank in the V shape. And you get one of one of them. It, and basically, it, like what it says in the tooltip, um, toggled with toggled with a redstone signal. So right now. This redstone signal is off, so the irrigation valve is open. But if it were to be on, this irrigation channel will close, and no, won't it won't let it water in at all to the sprinkler. And if it, as you can see, that one's open because there's getting it's getting water. And that one's closed because it's not getting water. So if I were to close it up slowly but surely, this is going to fill up. And if I were to turn this on. It's water starts going into it and it's starting to work again. These so this one is gonna keep on working just because there's there it already has a reserve of water. Um just like I said over there. Uh these valves reserve uh save the water it has in in them and it's and it won't uh be lost unless you break them or you use up the water inside. And that's basically the uh the valve, the water and the water tank. That's it for part one of AgroCraft. Those are all the blocks and and things like that. Uh, next, uh, and then that's the first part. The next part will be on the seed analyzer, the actual seeds, and the, oops, and the tools in AgroCraft. But for now, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, next episode or the next part will come soon. And uh, until next time, thanks for watching.